I'm Libby Settles and I'm the Executive Director of Wilderness Trace Child Development Center and we are located in Danville, Kentucky and serve Boyle, Lincoln, Garrett, Mercer, Casey, Pulaski counties. We um, are so incredibly grateful to Kentucky Colonels for impacting our center. They have provided new flooring incredible spaces for us to provide one-on-one -on -one therapy for the children that we serve ages two through eight. So before um, this, we had the grant through the Kentucky Colonels, we did not have any space for therapy other than one room that we have four therapists. So it was very limited in our ability to pull children. So now that we were able to move the office space to the basement, thanks to the grant, we have this entire space for treatment for occupational therapy and for speech therapy, which is so important to be able to pull kids who are either distracted in the classroom or need direct intervention one-on-one -on -one, or even a co-treatment with both therapists and one child. We I'm going. Okay, so this is um, an area we have bolted for a swing and it's really important for us to have a space to be able to do this so that we can work on some upper body strength and some inner ear processing. Can we show them how it works? Here we go. 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 Here we to use a variety of swings, but having the space to swing is really important. This is our bubble tube and it helps children calm down whenever they're having a really hard time self-regulating their bodies. A lot of our children with autism need help from adults and others so that they can stay calm and participate in school. So this is just a tool that's very visually calming and it also vibrates, which is calming for children as well. Let's see where you turn it on. Oh, a lot of kids also, this helps elicit language. It's going up. It's going up. You see our fish? And the fish can help with visual tracking, with finger isolation, so a lot of developmental skills. He's going down. Here. He's going down. So watch him go down, 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 down. It also comes with a controller, which we can use to help change colors. And then we come back. We can come back up. <gasps> and helps change colors and it has a switch so that we can work on children who are in a wheelchair that maybe don't have access to some of the other toys. Yeah. So the swell flooring that Kentucky Colonels paid for 100% provided us with an opportunity to one, um, create a space that is a little bit more fun it was a sterile, crumbling linoleum floor, and we um, really utilize this space in such a unique way. We have children that come down the hallway for physical therapy, occupational therapy, on scooter boards and bicycles that are adapted. And so you wouldn't think much of a hallway. But this one also, we created the stripes to mark progress for each child. So they're at specific measurement points. And that is really a wonderful way for them to visually track their progress and their goals. Room, and this is where we have the opportunity to engage in play and social um, experiments with friends and we have balance team, we have different kinds of therapy equipment and the colonels have helped us by installing a new swing in our space and provided a big thick mat so that the children will have a safe place to land. 
storage only and it was concrete blocks and a cement floor and it was um, stacked with items that needed to be free <laughs> and because of Kentucky Colonel's grant last year we were able to completely renovate the space to create admin spaces for our therapy team and some co-treating areas, but the best part was that it enabled us to use an office that five people had space desks in to create that one-on-one -on -one therapy space. As a director and being in charge of a facility that's aging, the colonels have been so gracious to accommodate us in our needs for new foreign, new appliances. Um, items that aren't warm and fuzzy, um, maybe like a swing or playground equipment, but they are the fundamental needs that we have as a school serving children with special needs.